comer? Ah, vai lá comer um bom fungo. Ah, bom. talvez mais tarde. Oh. oh. internet it is quarter to nine in the morning and welcome back to the channel welcome here in Luanda Angola I am now getting ready to leave but before I go uh, I just have to fix a few things because I got my tablet replaced remember that I managed to destroy the USB port in Congo but I replaced it and this is probably the piece of equipment I'm getting the most questions about since the start of the season. And well, besides the fact that I used the wrong wire to charge it and destroyed it, I'm super happy with it. That's why I bought another one. And I actually bought it from Willem, who is a guy uh, who's very much into rally racing. I met him at the Baja Rally. The rally I can start it. You sell them? Yeah. Uh, and he had one and I was like, that is really awesome. So you can use it for rally, but it's an Android, so you can just use any app. So I can just use it for navigation. So I'll put the link. So if you're interested, you know where to find it. I've just been so happy with it that I bought another one. This one is a little different though, because now I can also charge it here. So maybe um, that's really good for me. So I can't um, pick the wrong cable because now this is how the charging port looks like. Uh, and it comes with a special cable. So. I won't be making the same mistake again. And then the other piece of equipment that I was going to show you is this vest that I'm wearing. It's actually a sample. It's not out yet. Uh, Revit sent it to me. It's going to come out, I think, later this year, but I already get to test a sample. And it actually, it replaces my backpack. It, it's all in one. So now I have my neck brace together with the vest that also has uh, a water supply in the rear, but it's actually much lower on the back. So it's a bit, the weight distribution I think is a bit nicer with this vest. And then I have all sorts of pockets. So I'm, I'm pretty excited about it, just it out. And then I have two new cameras. Uh, one that I'm filming with right now and one on my helmet. But I won't go into detail with the cameras now. I'll do that on, the, on my academy page. Where am I going today? Before I go anywhere, um, I still need to buy an insurance here in Luanda. Obrigada. Bom dia. Tchau. Tchau, tchau. Bom dia. All right, I have my insurance. You know, you better get all the papers in order. <laughs> and then, yeah, let's see how Alaska rides. So far, so good. But uh, she was mainly riding terribly at higher speeds. I had a lot of power loss, but now... Well, if, if I diagnosed her correctly, and the problem I had to do with the water in the tanks, that shouldn't be a problem anymore. Because we drained all the tanks and cleaned everything, so... Hopefully, uh, no more problems. So far, so good, so... make a stop uh, here because just well you can't see it from here but there are some really cool rocks <laughs> that I wanted to see but it's raining so it's not really nice in the rain
wow, they really don't want you to go fast here, eh? <laughs> Not really sure why. There's nothing here. Just gonna see if I can actually fit my rain jacket on top of my vest. Because it just keeps on raining. I don't really want to be all drenched. I had a feeling it was going to rain today, that's why <laughs> I already have my rain jacket handy. So of course not really designed for what I'm going to, for what I'm about to do. Get stuck. Fits, right? It's just a bit tight, that's all. No way, no way, no. Okay. No fuel. <laughs> there should be another one. A bit further. Why does it look so empty? Bon dia. Bon dia. Ten gasolina. Yes. <laughs> Opa. Completo. Huh? Uh, see, I tell you two tank. Aqui, e aqui, e também quero esse também. Ah, tá, tá bem. Okay, <laughs> começamos aqui. Tudo bem? <laughs> Fuel, yes, plenty as well. So I'll just backtrack two kilometers or so because there I'm gonna take the turn off to Mushima, my destination for today. Let me stop here. And uh, take my rain jacket off again because <laughs> now it's hot and it's now 12 o'clock. I still haven't seen any place to have a breakfast, let alone lunch. But I do have a muesli bar with me, so I'm just going to eat that. It's only 100 kilometers left, so um, then I'll see if I can have a nice dinner maybe <laughs> in Mushima. <laughs> I really like how they all greet you with Amiga here in Angola. Hey Amiga! <laughs> ah. <laughs> very, very friendly people everywhere here. I like it. I 
I'm really enjoying this ride today. It's so relaxed and beautiful everywhere. I'm almost there. Oh, some road is gone. 10 kilometers to go. And then I'm in Mushima. And Mushima lies right at the river Kwanza. See, this is the river. That's the river Kwanza. Just like the currency here in Angola. The money is also called Kwanza. Ah. Okay. Okay. Obrigado. Vai almoçar com a gente? Comer? Vai lá comer um bom fundo. Ah. Talvez mais tarde. Primeiro eu estou buscando um hotel. Um hotel. Um hotel. Yeah. É o antigo hotel é Sorriti que agora é a base da Casais e a Matapalo. Okay. E aqui está a Greener. Ah, aqui esse hotel Greener. também. É uma base que também é um hotel. Ah, ok. Ok, então vai lá para atualizar com o pessoal. Hum? Tem que se atualizar lá com o pessoal para saber como é que é. Ah, ok. Ok. Foi a pergunta. Chega lá, okay. vai lá. Obrigada. Já. Tchau. Aqui. Ah. O Hotel Ritz. Não é aqui hotel, não. Hotel? Okay. Yeah. Aqui não tem hotel. Aqui não. Em Moshima, não há hotel. Não, não tem hotel. Em tudo Moshima. Tudo oh. Right, I have a new plan. <laughs> It's only another 186 kilometers. <laughs> looking for the key so I can park Alaska inside. He's like, oh, you can park on the street, but I prefer to have her out of sight. Um, anyway, there was just a bunch of kids walking past Alaska. And the one kid, he was asking me something. I didn't know what he was saying, but he shouted at me, hey, Tia, Tia. I think he said, which means auntie, right? I think it's the same in Portuguese as it is in Spanish. It makes me feel very old when kids are calling me auntie. <laughs> well, I mean, I am an aunt, but still, it makes me feel old. I just hope that they find the key and then uh, I'm gonna put my stuff in the room and then I'm gonna just walk to the river and have a look. bit of a tight entrance but this is my room for tonight I don't know 
what happened to the lamp. Let me draw in where I end up today because now I am here in Dondo. But I actually <laughs> rode first down and then here to Mushima where I couldn't stay. But then there's the river and you can't cross here and there's no roads. So I had to go back up and then back down again. So that's where I am now. Let's have a look at the river and then, oh, I am so hungry now. I went all day on that one uh, muesli bar. <laughs> so I'm gonna check out the river and just walk to all those uh, eat trees that I passed. That looks pretty nice. Oh, the setting of this town is amazing. It's like super green and there's hills in the back, then the river on that side. And then over there, there's like mountains in the distance and yeah, it is <laughs> so beautiful here. I am really liking this. See, there's a small village on the other side of the water and I see some canoes as well. We're going up and down. Oh, so pretty. It's kind of cute. I can hear children singing from across the river there. Even with the motorbikes here that are driving behind me, I can still hear the kids singing there. What do you fish. Fish? Fish. Oh. Oh. Um pequeno. Yes? No, no, mais, mais, mais pequeno. <laughs> yes? Okay. Yeah. So they are slowly putting food in front of me, but they cover it, um, I think for flies or something. So I already have three things, but I think we're waiting until the fish is ready. Obrigada. Okay, yeah. And then I have some beans. Salsa. And this is plantain. Well, bon appetit. This looks amazing. Wow, that was an amazing meal. 
I kind of regretted not picking the bigger fish because <laughs> it was so good. Super fresh and oh. Uh, and the salsa was amazing. Ah, oh, that was just a really, really good meal. And then, yeah, so a fish like that, with everything uh, with it and the water, they charge four dollars. Anyway, I am going to walk back to the hotel uh, before it gets dark. So that was it for today. I really hope you like this kind of relaxing episode today. I certainly did. Anyway, if you did, please give a big thumbs up, subscribe down below, and then I will see you in the next video.